What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Your Nest thermostat works great, but what happens if you're in another room? Well, Nest has thought about that because there's a lot of times that you're going to uh, either spend in another room or retire to another room, uh, most often maybe a bedroom, and all of a sudden that room becomes the most important room to control temperature-wise. Now, uh, in my house, my uh, bedroom is on the second floor, and so when you're down on the first floor and then call it quits to the other level, what ends up happening is that the temperature that was really comfortable in the main floor may not be the right temperature for the second floor. So what do you need to do? Well, you need to get one of these Nest temperature sensors. They're not that expensive. And what it does is it adds a whole new dimension of kind of smartness to your home. Looks like we have paperwork here. And then you get the little sensor right here and it's a screw. So what you get is this little dot sensor and you can put this in another room that you want to be basically the temperature controller for the thermostat for a certain period of time. Now, I don't think the app gives you unlimited amount of flexibility, but it should give you enough so that you don't have to kind of adjust the thermostat. Now, if you adjust it enough, the thermostat is gonna kind of learn, but especially if you have rooms that are really different temperatures, upstairs to downstairs, rooms that are well lit by sun or not, or rooms that are on a cold side or whatever. And so this will give the, the thermostat something else to read and kind of uh, use as its primary temperature source. As you can see here, it's only about an inch thick. It's kind of this matte finish, white plastic, like the Nest Thermostat E is. You've got Nest on there just a little bit right there. Looks like we have this to pull out, which is probably going to activate the battery. We also have a QR code. Looks like we have a little, um, little cover there for replacing the battery. And then the screw that was included here is, uh, looks like it's got a little ridge in there. So you can screw this into the wall and then It'll lock in place and you can hang this on the wall. I also think that you could just put this on, you know, a shelf or on your nightstand or something like that, anywhere where it's gonna get a pretty good reading on the room. So let me get this set up and show you how it works. So the first thing I'm gonna do here is open up my Nest app and I'm gonna go up here to the gear icon, the settings, and I am going to add down here product and I'm going to access the camera, and because this little dot came with a QR code, I'm gonna go ahead and scan that. I'm gonna hit next, and I'm gonna connect. All right, connected. Pull the battery tab. Tap next. I'm gonna find a good spot to put it in. Now check the connection. Apparently this will need to be within uh, Bluetooth or Wi-Fi range. I'm not entirely sure, but I've heard people kind of say 30 feet is about the maximum range. Looks like I found it. Where did I put this Nest temperature sensor? I am going to put it into the bedroom. And this shows you how to install it. And then I think we're all done. Now the nice thing is if you want this to take over like the bedroom to take over you can just tap it here and that will uh, control the thermostat itself but you can also set a schedule and we can just tap here to sensor schedule and then i can set this to evening i want it to use the bedroom sensor and that's really what I wanted to do. So when I go to bed, I know that my room is either going to be cooled off in the summer or warmed up in the winter because sometimes it's really uncomfortable during the day. So that's really it. And now, as you might be able to see here, um, it's still saying that the, the house thermostat is the sensor that it is um, using right now, but eventually that'll switch over to the bedroom. So there it is. That's how you use it. If you need to control your smart thermostat with even more control, from various places in your house. Check out the Nest Thermostat Remote Sensor. I'll put a link to it in the description. Peter Von Panda out.